we've been talking about, something we've unfortunately been uh, uh, been discussing, and it's uh, it's it's come to this. Atal Bihari Vajpayee, no more, uh, passing away this evening, uh, just a little after five o'clock. Uh, it's 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 coming as a shock to one and all. Uh, Mr. Nagam, your first reactions. My first reaction is Om Shanti, and I hope he achieves moksha and uh, is relieved from the cycle of death and birth, and uh, and 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 and. and and uh, you know amalgamates with the Paramatma. Om Shanti. Atal Bihari Vajpayee, no more. He's uh, he breathed his last as that uh, medical bulletin just uh, confirmed to uh, uh, just just confirmed all that information. Let me just uh, once again highlight uh, what exactly that release has said. This was uh, issued by the Media and Protocol Division. Uh, and you can see that uh, we put out that report. I'm just going to go through the text of that. It is with profound grief that we inform about the sad demise of former Prime Minister of India, Sri Atal Bihari Vajpayee, at 5.05 uh, today. Mr. Vajpayee was admitted uh, to the All India Institute of Medical Sciences uh, on the 11th. Uh, and uh, he was uh, stable in the last nine weeks under the care of the doctors. Unfortunately, his condition deteriorated. I'm going to hand it over to Bhupen Chaube now to take us through the rest of the news. What a sad day. And what a sad moment. Atal Bihari Vajpayee, one of the true legends of Indian politics, unfortunately now not managing to beat the odds which were heavily stacked against him. Former Prime Minister Atal Bihari Vajpayee, according to the press release which has now been issued, that medical bulletin that we were all talking about uh, from the All India Institute of Medical Sciences, uh, that medical bulletin has declared that Atal Bihari Vajpayee is dead. Uh, and there are very clear cut details which have been given. That Atal Bihari Vajpayee passed away at 5.05, .05, at 5 past 5 p.m. His condition had deteriorated over the last 36 hours. He was put on life support systems, but despite the best of efforts, the country has lost him today. And we join the nation in deeply mourning the great loss. That's the, that's the, the verdict which has been given by the All India Institute of Medical Sciences. And as we were, we were, we were anticipating this now over the better part of uh, the last 12 hours. From the time the Prime Minister started making frequent trips to All India Institute of Medical Sciences, yesterday Narendra Modi came in the evening to call on Atal Bihari Vajpayee. He came twice today in the morning. Rajnath Singh, the Home Minister, was there. And the entire rank and file of India's political ecosystem, frankly, has either reached All India Institute of Medical Sciences today, they have gone and they have seen They've probably got a last glimpse of, of Atal Bihari Vajpayee. From Yogi Aditya to Shivat Singh Chauhan to Vasundra Rajay to Naveen Patnaik to Mamta Banerjee to you name it. In fact, one of the last people to have, uh, to have gone and visited the Institute was, uh, was Rahul Gandhi. Uh, the Congress president and Rahul Gandhi has also given a very detailed statement where he says the nation has lost a great leader in the form of, uh, of Atal Bihari Vajpayee. He says that Atalji was a leader who listened into people and respected even in the even the opposition. We will, we will of course look at the politics, uh, the the impact, uh, what Atal Bihari Vajpayee stood for, and how, in his passing away, while the country certainly has lost a great leader, does it also imply that it's the end of an era, the end of uh, the era of politics of consensus, politics of conciliation. In many ways, it began from 2014. And I think now, with the passing away of Atal Bihari Vajpayee, I think that era certainly seems to come to an end. President of India has also expressed his deep condolences. President of India Ramnath Kovind is saying that extremely sad to hear the passing away of Sri Atal Bihari Vajpayee. He's describing him as a true Indian statesman. His leadership, foresight, maturity, and eloquence put him in a league of his own. Atalji, the gentle giant, will be missed by one and all. Interesting way to describe him, Atalji, the gentle giant. Harunima is, uh, is there uh, with us live from outside uh, All India Institute. It's the end of an era. The Prime Minister's office says, Harunima, a gentle giant. The, pr the President of India describes him. What happens now? What's the protocol that will come into place now? Well, he will be taken to his residence, uh, and that preparation has been on since morning. I think even though Ames doctors have officially declared him dead at 5 or 5 p.m. on the 16th of August 2018, enough indications were given to his family and to the Bharatiya Janta Party that from here on it looks very difficult to revive him. 36 hours ago, as per that.